The fight over union rights in Wisconsin looks a lot different tonight than it did in 2011. Instead of rallies packing the state capitol, those trying to restore collective bargaining rights were in a Dane County courtroom today. But their goal is the same, getting rid of Act 10. A Dane County Circuit judge heard oral arguments in that case. He's tasked with determining whether the law is unconstitutional. Plaintiffs in the case argue they were not given the same protections as public safety unions like the state's Capitol Police and firefighters. They also argue that public safety officials were granted exemptions that were not offered to other public employees. A similar argument was brought forward in 2014 to the state Supreme Court's then conservative majority. Act 10 uh, created two categories of public employees, so-called general employees who are stripped of effectively all of their bargaining rights and so-called public safety employees who retained effectively all of their bargaining rights. The distinction that Act 10 created between these groups of employees lacks a rational basis. If the judge rules in the plaintiff's favor, it would restore public workers' rights to collective bargaining. 